So today is my second day here in Guyana and to be honest with you I want to drink all the bush tea or all the organic tea that I can drink while I'm here. So today is a lime leaf tea with milk and this is gonna be delicious for breakfast. Yesterday we had fever grass and tomorrow I have to figure out which organic tea I'm having. Organic freshly picked lime leaf is the best in the morning. A nice warm cup of tea with milk and sugar. Brown sugar from DDL Guyana. So today we're making a nice Guyana Bora potato, some tomatoes and some fried chicken. This is organic Bora, so I can't wait to dig into this with some nice pepper sauce or achar. So guys, we're going to run a few errands and I'm taking you along with me. I'm gonna share some video with the drive along and let you guys see the East Bank Road as I go along. So stay tuned. This drive here is the East Bank heading toward Georgetown. The traffic here is always, always jam-packed and so busy. Heading towards Tong this time in the day, it's around 10 to 11 in the day. It's not so busy going up, but going towards the airport side from Georgetown is actually really, really busy on the other side, if you notice. I wouldn't be making it all the way to Georgetown today but I will take you all there one day before my trip is over. In Guyana, some of the vehicles, the driver's side is on the right hand. In North America, most of the vehicle, the driver's side is on the left hand side. So it's kind of awkward sitting in the front seat with my dad and I'm actually on the left hand side, which in that is usually my driver's side. All those who remember Royal Castle. This was one of the most popular fast food chicken place here in Guyana. So we stop here to pick up some vegetable and provision from this local stall holder. I like when I come to Guyana to support all the little small businesses because these people work very hard on a daily basis and the sun in Guyana is very hot at the moment. Everybody is complaining that it is extremely hot at this time. So we have the hasa here and we have a good amount. Check this out guys. We are cooking the hassa curry today. Me and my mom, she already have all the ingredients ready. We have the oil warming up. And let me show you what we have here. So we have green seasoning here. Jeera, mixed masala, curry powder, and some pepper. So we're gonna add onion later. We she have here some okra, tomato. We have the mangoes here and the hasa curry in Guyana. Must have mangoes if you don't have anything else. And coconut milk. Coconut milk add a nice creamy riches to the gravy and give that hasa a really sweet flavor. So if you're cooking hasa and you're missing out on the coconut milk and green mango, try this the next time and you'll really enjoy it. So guys, now it's time to chunky the hassa curry. That's what you call it, chunky. So this is what we're gonna do here now. You hear that song? That's the sizzling of chunky in curry and fireside. Mm -hmm. 
So we're gonna cook this mm, until it becomes nice and fragrant and starts sticking to the bottom. And then we're gonna go in with a little bit of water to make sure that all the spices are well open up and have good flavor in with the ingredients. So we're gonna add some salt while it's cooking. We're gonna give this a mix. And it smells really nice. The whole neighborhood is smelling it. Really nice. Going with some water now, and we're gonna leave this to cook for a bit. So we're gonna add our onions now, and then we're gonna mix this. Look, it looks really, really good. My mom made all the mixture of the ingredients and all the additional stuff that we're adding mango okra tomato and all that good stuff my mom prepared all those things so this is teamwork i'm just turning the pot so guys i'm sweating to cook this hot korean fire side but it's worth every bit of it because the sweetness when you cook this food on fire side is amazing so if you look in here you can see that this is running oil and that's how you know you're ready to add your hasa in here now. So I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna go in with the hasa. So, so hasa is going in. Nice big hasa. The fire side is too big for me out here, so I'm going on top of it to turn this up. Wow, this is really nice big hot. I have to really mix it up well, so all that good stuff can well and flavor up these hasa. And we're gonna let all the natural water completely evaporate before we go in with our coconut milk and our additional stuff. Guys, really nice. So we're gonna go in with our coconut milk here. And this is all naturally squeezed coconut milk. We have to put a good amount because this is a lot of hasa and we want it to cook really nice and flavorful. The fireside heat, I love cooking on the fireside guys, but the one thing that bothers me is the smoke in my eyes. So we're gonna get it, we're gonna give this a nice mix so that all that beautiful flavor can mix in with the coconut milk. And we're gonna let it cook on low heat until it's beautifully done. So mango is going in now. And I have a mango for all the YouTube family. Nice fresh Diana green mango. And okra and tomato. Mommy put it in now? Yes. And the okra and tomato is going in. Right now for this curry, ma my mom is the director. I'm only the actor today. And pepper, we have a half of a pepper here. Look. And I'm gonna take this stem out and this is boiling. We add the other half of the pepper into the curry paste. Look how nice this is. We'll show you guys back when it's fully done. So guys, we have fresh saijan or moringa to put in the pasta curry. And my mom is just peeling up these. Now these came from my from my sister yard. My sister-in-law just picked them and brought them over. So we're gonna load this curry up with some good moringa. 
yes and I'm gonna add them now to the curry so I just noticed that these chickens are jumping up here to go in the trees to sleep this is not where my mom said they sleep at night one is already in the mango tree and look the other ones are coming up in the tree now oh my god this is the most strangest thing I ever seen I've never seen chicken climb tree to sleep in at night only in Guyana these things happen guys and when you're lucky you get to see all these beautiful things so that's why we say oh beautiful Guyana look at that Let this water go down a little bit more and these will be ready soon. It's looking good guys and smelling nice. Our hasa curry is done and it's now time for us to serve up. Friends, here is my plate of hasa curry, saijan, okra, green mango and I'm going in with my hands for this food and especially when you're in Guyana, you have to go in with your hands. It's just finished. Even though it's hot, Ghana is really hot right now, I'm going to mix up some mango and I'm drooling, you guys know me. I usually drool up before I get the food and mix it well and I'm going to go in for a mouthful for all the viewers. This hassle was alive when we cleaned it. Cheers. Oh my god. Before I say anything, children in the background, how was the hassle curry? Really, really good. With that green mango, everything is fresh. Mm -mm -mm. Amazing. So guys, I'm gonna sit down. The entire family is eating. The kids are eating. My parents, my sister-in-law. I'm gonna go join them and enjoy my hasa curry and take my time and eat every piece of it. So catch you guys later. Bye for now. Today I was very happy to meet up with one of my Guyanese sister, Miss Dianne Glasgow who is a cultural and Guyanese storyteller. She is very well known on Facebook and YouTube, Are We Story Got Melody. Call them pigs. Mike, go bring the coconut oil for me. Yeah, really? Oh, your husband yeah. is Mike too. Uh -huh. Call them pick me. And when I call them pick me, I make sure I rub down with coconut oil. Me go take a little bit and me go give this girl a little bit. Okay, you and girl. You know, we just used to do them. You do so and do so. You remember that? And you do so and you do so. And then we go rub down with the coconut oil. And then me and she go do them pick me this. No, no, nothing. Because me want to see how much thing this girl know. All right? Are you ready? Let me rub down a little bit. And you say so? I'm a Put living proof place, of buddy. coconut oil. Mm. Oh, living gosh, me like, proof. Me like smell them to you, know, y'all. Mm -hmm. oh, this might be filthy mm. island, right? Exactly, <laughs> with little pepper and little oh, magnesium yes. shell. Oh, <laughs> cut up for them, girl. Oh, my mama. Oh, so, me go play with this girl. Them pick me this? No, no, nothing. Let me see what you know. Me yes. go start one rhyme. You go finish them off. Okay. You ready? Yes. Slip, let's slap, let's. slipper. Slip, slap, slippers. I don't know that one. Oh my god. Slip, slap, slipper. Daddy buy one slipper. Slipper boss. Daddy cost. Slip, slap, slipper. Oh my you don't know that one? Yes. <laughs> you don't know that one? Yes. Okay. What about this one? Benji give the cow water. Benji give the cow both. When the cow ready for hala, Benji jump in the car. <laughs> you get the one. You get the one. Oh god. Let me see one more. Um, which one? Abna Babna. Maybe, maybe see. Okay, we're gonna accept that. Ocean potion. Sugar and tea. Rose potato. English tea. Out goes she. <laughs> okay, good, the girl know. So after this, we go ask the girl something because you know she live outside. And let me tell her, I must follow this girl. This girl know for 
Coco Pal kind of thing. Me see this girl take mango. Where your channel name, girl? Charmin's Kitchen. I must watch Charmin's Kitchen. We're gonna leave the link down in this video. All right, so now go. All right, what is lofa? Lofa is um, dry nemo hawks. Give me five. This girl <laughs> knows something. All right, what is candy? What do um, sweetie? Yeah. <laughs> What is what do we call um jug lamp? Um bam jug them jug lamp. Me come from a barbies, we call it flambo. Oh yes, yes. you yes. never hear flambo. So, you know, chickpeas, they call in the thing chickpeas now as well. Shana <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> so Alright, an eggplant. Balanche. <laughs> yes, I got my god. <laughs> Hey, this girl know nothing. <laughs> now we don't say dishes in our Guinness Creole. It's what we just say. Where? Yes, girl. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <geez. laughs> okay, you go get all the things right. Be there with you. Uh, um, like you watch me think here. So, what do we call pancake? Chota roti. Mama. All right. Gum. Chico. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. Wait. Eh, 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 eh. Nail polish. Cute. <laughs> oh, Jesus, mommy. Like them baby rattle, no. what we just call baby shark shark. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this you know nothing, you know, Shami, you know nothing. We don't say um lotion. We just say cream. Our lotion yeah. is cream and because we don't cream, tell them yeah. our lotion in cream. Yeah. Cream. Now we don't say when gynees get diabetes, we don't say gynees get diabetes. Mm -hmm. What we don't say? Gynee, we get sugar. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, we don't say we get sugar. <laughs> yeah, and we don't say on the shirt. The thing that we wear underneath the shirt, the white thing, yes. what we just call it? Vest. Or um, flannel. No. What we call the thing we wear underneath your shirt. You know another one? Uh, oh, boy, let me help you. Uh -huh. We call it a singlet. Yes, singlet. Yes, yes. yes. we grandma, call it a singlet. singlet yes. yes, we call it a singlet. All round. right, you get. No matter, you get one round. We're talking about some. Uh -huh. One round you get. All right. Now, what we just call apple? Ice apple. Of course, because <laughs> <laughs> come from exactly. North America. Country. Exactly. All right, let me do two more. What is called soda? Um, color drink or sweet drink. Sweet drink, <laughs> yes, sir. Color drink. And the last one, long before this time, we never used to say suitcase. Mm -hmm. Guyanese used to say a suitcase. What is it? Um, suitcase. We have, one. One, we have one, but well, when you tell me, I don't remember. We used to call suitcase grip. Grip, yes. Yeah, we used I to remember call grip. Suitcase. Grip have a thing, and you just, it is flap on like yeah, this. Yeah, flap on, and then you just click, click. when it closed. Yes, yes that yes. was we suitcase long ago. Thank you so much for watching.